Hey everybody, I'm back in Copenhagen and I uh, came to my favorite restaurant, Joe and the Juice, and I've been thinking about their immunity drink for a while. It's got red, grapefruit, passion fruit, and apple. And uh, this man is making my drink right here. And then he's making me an avocado sandwich as well. It's uh, 90 Danish crones. I think that's how you say it. Praise the Lord. I'm back in Copenhagen. I'll be here until the 17th, and then I go to uh, Prague. Okay, I'm just sitting here waiting on my train, and uh, here's the train schedules. And if you notice the word Malmo, Malmo is in Sweden. And if you want to take a train from Copenhagen uh, right over to Sweden, you can. I did a research on this city and found out that they have a university with 24,000 students. second one and uh, as soon as I get to my destination which is one two three four five six more stops my apartment so I'm off the train station I went into 7-eleven to ask her how to get across the street she said there's a tunnel right here so I'm gonna take this tunnel but I noticed this this is good lamb food it'll be good cheap street food I'm gonna check it out tomorrow somebody's got a Nazi sign I'm not sure what that word is but uh, get the cute baby on the back it's really cold here so I'm kind of glad that Miami got cold my last day there so I didn't uh, panic here we go Got two jackets on, two shirts, and some sweatpants. Wear sweatpants because <laughs> you're going to want to be comfortable on the plane. Anytime you get on a plane, you do not want to wear tight shoes or tight anything because your feet swell. Good morning from Copenhagen, Denmark. Here is my balcony view. And uh, I slept pretty good. I slept till 10 a.m. And there's a lake over there. I'm gonna walk when it's not rain, uh, raining. It's supposed to storm today. But anyway, this is the view of the city. Hope you enjoy it. At night, there's a huge Christmas tree right here somewhere, and I could see it. It's very pretty. Um, that was where I came in from, and that's my grocery store. I just went and got some food. My room is very small, but I'm okay with that because um, my roommate's always at work or uh, at school. She's from China. And I'm cooking some fish, got it on sale, and taking some avocado and tomatoes. There's my olive oil, and I've got some beef and just some, uh, some yogurt there. Yeah, so that's all I'm going to eat. If you, if you know me, I've been on a diet. <clears throat> because my last trip to Europe I gained some weight so I've already lost all the weight that I gained my seven months here now I'm gonna keep going and lose all the other weight but this is healthy and uh, that's where I sleep I haven't made my bed I don't even make my bed when I had a home <clears throat> so anyway this is uh, my small little room praise the Lord and most of the brethren in the Lord having become confident about my chains, are much more bold to speak the word without fear. So 
Lord God, I thank you for my fish, my avocado and tomatoes and orange juice and for Johnny Cash reading the Bible on YouTube. God, I thank you for bringing me to Copenhagen, Denmark safely. I ask that Jesus Christ would be glorified and that you would save um, save my roommate, God, that you give me an open door to preach the gospel to her this week. In Jesus' name I pray, amen.